Bonita Marucha and our topic today is going to be on how to grow green onions from onion tubers and at the end of the day we're going to harvest onion scallions in which we're going to use them to cook eggs, Irish potatoes, potatoes, uh, mashed potatoes and the rest of the types of foods according to your taste. You're welcome as you follow this. Welcome as we're going to show you on how we're going to recycle our plastic bottles at home uh, to use them as uh, our home gardens. And today I'm here with my students. They can introduce themselves. My name is Ahmed Mohammed. I am in grade 5 and this is my younger brother. My name is Khalif and I am grade 4. Welcome as we are going to show you today how to plant green onions at home. Thank you. I'm going to show you today on how we can use our plastic bottles to plant uh, various things at home so that they cannot go away. That is, we recycle them by using them as uh, planting pots. So we have to cut them. So we are going to insert our onion tubers. I have to make slightly bigger holes so that when I'm going to put my onion here, the leaves are going to sprout out using this uh, uh, space. I'm going to use the cheaply available resources that we have at home. I'm using my knife like that. And then Another one, I will make it here. We don't have to make them. We don't have to make them to be uh, in a straight line. So that we can give the tubers spaces. Uh, such that at the end of the day, they cannot get disturbed. They'll just sprout out easily. Three holes. Let me make another one. So I can... It's very easy to cut this bottle because they are very, very light. You see now, at the end of the day, I have something like this, and I have another sample here. We make them like this. So I'm going to use my onions, uh, the tubers. I place one here, after putting some soil, I'll place one here, another one here, another one here, the other one here, and then I add some soil. And then at the end, I'm going to put a little manure and water. And then I'll put it outside. After everything, I'll put them outside so that they can get some light for at least two to three hours in a day. Our uh, tubers, onion tubers. I'm going to chop them at this far end. This is where we expect our leaves to come out from, and this is where the roots are going to grow from. This side is going to face the soil, and then this one is going to be uh, left out so that it can uh, sprout out to our green onions. And put them inside here, Caliph. Put them here. Yeah. The ones which are ready, just place them inside there. Okay, put it here. Amen. Remove these things like this and place them here. Now they are very, very much ready for us to start uh, planting them in our soil. We have our soil here. We have our containers, our plastic containers. And then we have our water here. This is our manure. That is waste from the uh, our hands that we wear in our compound. 
and you know they are so rich in urea. Don't mind even if the table is going to be dirty. Just continue doing your thing. Yeah, you have to put them to be like this so that the leaves are going to sprout out like that. Just add the soil, add it. Don't mind, we have enough soil. Yeah, like this. And then uh, you can use this. Use this, add it. I have to add some soil, we have enough soil. Yeah, you try to be fast, hammered. You see now I've covered this onions. Now that's enough. Put your onions here now to be upright like this. Space them so that these ones are going to grow up. Like that. I think those are enough because there's no big space. You can add your soil now to the field. Calif. Add your soil and you look up as you do your things. Now I'm going to place these ones this way. To be upright now, I'm not going to put them to slant. Because for these that are on the top, are going to sprout out upright. So I add some soil this side and this side. You have to remove, to remove the bigger particles, just as, as I'm doing, and then do like this. So I that to be like this. So this is our first day to do this. I'm not going to cover the top. Yeah. You have to make sure that the place at which the roots are going to sprout out looks upwards. Hamid, you can add here one so that it can go to, to grow upwards. Now add your soil, but don't cover the part where the leaves are going to sprout out from. Now we have to add, we have our manure here. I'm going to put a little. A little manure. Yes, you can use your cup. Put a little. At least one cup. You can add Hamid. Khalif, you can add the manure. Yeah, with me, I can just pick it like this. You know, farmers do not fear that so I can use my hands like this now I think we are ready to add water some water into our pots remember these are plastic bottles that we are using today we are recycling them so that our environment cannot be Dirtified by the bottles that are being thrown all over the places. So let's add some water. You can add some water using your cups. that have to add some water like that because you saw at first our soil was very dry you know in Nairobi we have very dry soil and it takes a lot a lot of time a long time for it to rain in our county here in Nairobi so we have to add some water because the soil was very very much dry and we're going to keep doing this for some time but we are not going to put a lot of water to make them rot. A little water, a little water. To prepare our uh, tubers, onion tubers, I'm going to chop them. 
at this far end. This is where we expect our leaves to come out from and this is where the roots are going to grow from. This side is going to face the soil and then this one is going to be uh, left out so that it can sprout out to our green onions. And put them inside here, Caliph. Put them here. Yeah. The ones which are ready, just place them inside there. Okay, put it here. Amen. Remove these things like this and place them here. Now they are very, very much ready for us to start uh, planting them in our soil. We have our soil here. We have our containers, our plastic containers. And then we have our water here. This is our manure. That is waste from the uh, our hands that we rear in our compound. And you know they are so rich in urea. That's going to help our soil composition. So uh, let's put our soil into our containers. Put your soil in your containers. The level where the, the holes are, we remove the big stones from inside. Uh, try to be fast. Okay, let me assist you. Now remove the, 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 the bigger stones, bigger particles. Remove the bigger particles. Okay, like that. Pick your onion. Pick your onion. Okay. Uh, if the soil has not reached, you can add pure soil. That is. Like that, remove the bigger stones. Now put put your onion. Place your onion. Make sure that the part that the the leaves are going to sprout out from faces outside. Faces outside. Add, add your soil. If it does not reach there, you have to add your soil. You can use the cup, Hamid. Yeah, like this. Don't mind even if the table is going to be dirty. Just continue doing your thing. Yeah, you have to put them to be like this so that the leaves are going to sprout out. Like that. Just add the soil, add it. Don't mind, we have enough soil. Yeah, like this. And then uh, you can use this, use this, add it. I have to add some soil, we have enough soil. Yeah, try to be fast, hammered. You see now I've covered this onions. Now that's enough, put your onions here, now to be upright, like this, space them, so that these ones are going to grow up, like that, I think those are enough, because there is no big space, you can add your soil now, to the field, Calif, add your soil and look up as you do your things, now I'm going to place these ones, this way, to be upright, now I'm not going to put them to slant, because for this, that are on the top are going to sprout out uprightly. So I add some soil this side and this side.
you have the remo to remove the bigger particles just as, as I'm doing and then like this so I that to be like this so this is our first day to do this I'm not going to cover the top yeah you have to make sure that the place at which the roots are going to sprout out looks upwards. Hamid, you can add here one so that it can go to, to grow upwards. Now add your soy, but don't cover the part where the leaves are going to sprout out from. Now we have to add, we have our manure here. We're going to put a little, a little manure. Yes, you can use your cup. Put a little, at least one cup. You can add, Hamid. Khalif, you can add the manure. Yeah, with me, I can just pick it like this. You know, farmers do not fear that. So I can use my hands like this. Now I think we are ready to add water, some water into our pots. Remember these are plastic bottles that we are using today. We are recycling them so that our environment cannot be gratified by the bottles that are being thrown all over the places. So let's add some water. You can add some water using your cups. Like that, have to add some water like that because you saw at first our soil was very dry. You know, in Nairobi, we have very dry soil, and it takes a lot, a lot of time, a long time for it to rain in our county here in Nairobi. So we have to add some water because the soil was very, very much dry, and we're going to keep doing this for some time. But we are not going to put a lot of water to make them rot. A little water, a little water. Now, see what we do, what we have done. This is what we have done. And as at the end of the day, we're going to have our onions grow uh, like this. And how are we going to harvest this? our green onions. This is what we expect. We have this, these are green onions maturing up like this. We're going to cut our leaves, we call them scallions. And we can use these scallions at the end of the day to cook our eggs, our Irish potatoes at home, our potatoes, uh, some other types of food depending on the tribe and the taste of each person. You're very much welcome and let us please subscribe to our YouTube channel which is Progress TV by Teacher Leonita and our Facebook at uh, Kanana Marusha Leonita. Thank you very much and welcome into our next episode which is going to be growing garlic at home. And we're going to show you how to do it uh, within a few seconds. This is our garlic. Look at this side. This is the part in which the roots are going to sprout out from. And this upper side, you know we have this garlic the way it is. When we remove these parts, we're going to remove them like this. We remove them like this. These are called garlic gloves 
garlic cloves. We're going to plant our garlic from these cloves. This is the part in which the roots are going to come out from and this is the part in which the leaves are going to sprout out from. So in our next class this week, uh, most probably on Wednesday, we're going to show you on how we're going to grow our garlic at home. Let's keep our environment clean by recycling our plastic bottles, uh, plastic containers at home. Welcome as we continue to learn and grow together. Stay safe at home. Thank you and welcome into our next lesson. Thank you very much.